We accept the choice the country made. Come on, man. Gay, 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 gay. Hey, yo. So, <clears throat> a few things on the list today I wanted to just talk about. First things first. I've been gone for a minute. And a bunch of things have been going on lately. But... I'm I'm not even going to try and hold myself to a daily thing anymore because that's just silly of me to even try at this rate. I'm going to just try and upload videos to my best ability when I can. A lot of things going on. Hope y'all understand. But something uh, interesting. First of all, Trump is elected. I said that in pot potentially the last video. I have a few videos that I've been uh, prepared but have not been edited yet so don't know which is coming out first or not anywho but that does not mean the work is done because I live in Canada and I'm gonna hold no secret that eventually I plan on moving myself over to America and not stay in Canada for a bunch of reasons but while I'm in Canada and after I'm not in Canada I don't want Trudeau to be our Prime Minister so I'm gonna try my best to hold the conservative opinion and get Trudeau out by voting in Pierre Polyev. So my work is not done at all, nearly, by being a, a political commentator on this stuff. But another thing I want to talk about is <clears throat> we're on YouTube. I hope y'all understand what that means. A lot of the time it's about reactionary stuff. And I find that faking my reactions is a lot more to me than having the reactions come naturally. What I mean by that is rather than doing a uh, prepared content, I'm gonna try and move towards doing uh, more typical me reaction stuff, which would include natural reactions to things or natural thoughts and feelings. So rather than preparing a topic, I'm gonna just look through the trending page, I'm gonna click on this, be like, ah, Trump cheated, what is this all about? And what you find out is it is a bunch of just, uh, <laughs> memes about people who think, uh, people, I'm assuming people started the, the hashtag, Trump cheated, because they thought that Trump cheated, and then a bunch of Republicans, Republicans came in and were like, eh, take these memes. And so, I plan to just do a more natural reaction stuff to to what I am looking at. Like this, for example, uh, Harris 2028, absolutely not. Repeal the, <clears throat> not gonna say that, probably not safe for YouTube. Uh, got female, woman, person, human, dishwash her. Oh my goodness, the Illuminati confirmed, damn. Um, mystery solved. Trump cheated. He deleted. <laughs> okay, okay. So for those who don't know, there's a conspiracy thing going around, like uh, how Biden had 20 million more votes, and now the 20 million are just poof gone. They're not here. So. A lot of people are thinking, uh-oh, SpaghettiOs, they did something fucky-wucky with the machines for voting. And now there's a bunch of the... I, the joke is... I'm not going to explain it. I'm not going to dissect a frog for you. You understand the joke. That's pretty funny, though. Wow. That's amazing. Wow, th this is a... Uh, that's actually interesting to look at. There are no blue states, just 15 to 20 big blue cities trying to tell the rest of us how to live. That, that is a complete and utter fact. Um, I haven't seen a man beat, oh my goodness. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> holy, wow that is not safe for YouTube. <laughs> oh, that's just funny, oh my goodness. If you think that Trump cheated, you're in an election denier. And a threat to democracy. Lems the rules. I love that. <laughs> uh, I, I, I love the memes. I'm going to be honest, guys. 
A lot of people have issue with Grok being like a complete, uh, free platform. You don't have to, there's no, uh, like, you don't have to try and fit words around to get a certain product. You just have to use the words and Grok will make it. I like Grok. I like it. That, uh, Grok, I know, I, I'm assuming this is someone just who clipped a bunch of photos together to get this, but a lot of Grok images are just fun to look at. Oh. <laughs> I've seen this before. This was th my favorite <laughs> hashtag Trump uh, cheated uh, post. Trump colluded with Jesus. God clearly overreached his authority by manipulating bullets to graze his ear and preventing a successful This is a clear violation of the Constitution, separation of church and state, and is disqualifying. <laughs> Who is creating these? I like it. <laughs> uh, a very good meme. Very good. Oh, why is President Biden trending why is he here i have never seen president biden speak this clearly and sharply before how come after they lost the elections he suddenly becomes so bright they must have been doing something to run the country for themselves instead of letting him run it it is very clear he voted for trump their own leaders and they do it peacefully and we're in a democracy the will of the people. I didn't. I didn't even have to watch the whole entire thing. Yeah, that's absolutely. He's like Biden. Typically, he speaks like, <sighs> like he's got a lot of air exhaling from him while he's speaking. But here, it is clear. Suspicious behavior. Um, I'm gonna be honest. I, I know this is probably a a a, a controversial statement, but. I like Biden. Why are you gay? <laughs> I, I like how after he was booted out, he became a, a knife just going to the back of the Democrats the entire time. Because I loved it. I loved it. And then he went into that uh, rally or something and he, he wore an actual hat. I'm pretty sure Biden is pro-Trump. I'm pretty sure. And I'm also pretty sure this ain't Biden. Uh, absolutely is not Biden. <laughs> I don't know what to say. This right here is uh, not Biden. But I think Biden voted Trump. I, I kind of like the old dude, you know? He's fun. And then they had an entire conversation about golfing on their debate. That was pretty funny. <laughs> D disappointing as to how presidents on, an, on a debate are talking about golfing, but funny because you're just just two old people being two old people like it's just funny it's just funny um democrats are in complete disarray right now and they don't understand why they lost joe biden was the worst president in american history and kamala harris was complicit in all the failed policies of the administration but kamala harris what? My gosh. what do you guys think the dynamic is like right now between Kamala Harris and Joe Biden? Do you think there's animosity? Because he's being blamed for a lot of it, and I don't think it's deservedly... Absolutely. I'm happy about it. Biden, I think, I think Biden's chill. I'm gonna be honest. I think Biden's chill. <laughs> he went up against Kamala because she's like, she booted him off and he was like, eh, screw you. <laughs> I'll, I'm, I'm with him. I'm gonna be honest. I, I like the, I like the energy I'm getting from Biden these days. That's a funny old dude. <laughs> President Biden said, Yesterday I spoke with President-elect Trump to congratulate him on his victory. And I assured him... Oh, hold on. <clears throat> hey, yesterday I spoke with President Biden... Uh, <clears throat> President-elect Trump to congratulate him on his victory. And I assured him that I would direct my entire administration to work with his team to ensure a peaceful and orderly transition. That's what the American people deserve. I'm gonna be honest. I think, I think, I think Biden is pro-Trump. I think, I think he didn't even have to tell them to peacefully do it because I think they would just agree with it because his entire team got just knocked off the, off the edge after they, they decided to kick him off and 
go for Kamala. So I'm pretty sure Biden and his entire team just allowed Trump to go in. They're like, ah, this ain't ours anyway, so just left. So I don't know. The country chooses one or the other. We accept the choice the country made. Come on, man. See, I don't get this. How is it that the entire Republican Party realizes that Biden is all of a sudden speaking clear and he is actually here, but someone like this, who is apparently a proud uh, weirdo, and they just think President Biden is actually here. <laughs> Forget about the entire quote or the entire thing that this person said. They just overlook the fact that this is a completely different person speaking. He went from the, the, the person to all of a sudden, all right, guys, today America is like speaking so clear and actually here. Like, how, how do you not realize the complete and utter difference in character that has happened here? What, they isn't just... They just roided, in him, roided him up all of a sudden for this singular speech. Like, I don't buy it. This is a complete and different person. It's not actually Joe Biden speaking there. I'm going to be doing different things on this channel. I'm also going to be doing things differently, just in general, as to how I'm doing things. First of all, I've got a webcam and... Uh, webcam. I'm just using my phone to record this. It is a weird system I got going on here, to be honest, but it's working, so it is what it is. But that is just about it for today's video, and hope y'all enjoy coming back for the next one, and I hope y'all have a good rest of your day. Have a good one, and I'll see you later.